haul video. I went to a mall that's about an hour away from where I live and found a new store so I was so excited. I think I'm kind of behind because I've talked to some of my friends and they all knew the store existed but I didn't. So let me start. I um, the store is called Love Culture and they do have a website so I'll put the website down at the bottom in notes. Um, now I did check the website out after I got back and I don't think that the clothes looks as nice as when you're in person in the store. But the clothes is pretty. So first what I got is a pair of pants. Um, and they're like a light blue color. You can see. And they're really stretchy if you're like me and you need stretch in your life to fit in pants. They're really stretchy. Um, and they're just really nice skinny and they're they're not really denim they're they're kind of denim like but not really denim so i i could probably wear these to work I, I will wear these to work actually i work in an office where it's business casual so you can only wear jeans on friday but i feel like with a dressy shirt and maybe a blazer or something i i could wear those and they're not denim at all so those are those and these were actually I don't know, but I want to say that they were $20. The tags ripped. Then I got another pair of blue pants, actually. These ones are, are trousers. And they're almost like um, cigarette pants, if you can see. They hit right at my ankle, a little bit above my ankle, actually. And they're um, definitely a, a more dressy, you know, fabric. They have some pleats in the front, and then they came with the blue belt. Just really pretty. You know, I'm excited for color blocking. Um, and I saw pants like these at Express, um, this exact same blue, the exact same shape. And at Express, they were probably $70 or $80. And these ones were only $18.90. So I was excited. Um, I also got another pair of pants. And, you know, these are the pants that they're kind of in right now. I call them man repellers. I tried them on. I think that they fit really pretty. They're um, a tan and black pattern. Um, and, you know, they're stretchy also. They have a belt across the waist. And I tried them on, and I actually bought a shirt to go with them. And it's just the simple black. Just because the fabric is so busy, I, I wouldn't, you know, wear anything. The, the fabric's busy enough. I'll keep it simple with these pants. So I just bought a, a black short sleeve or sleeveless cowl neck shirt and um, wear it tucked in the pants and you know I tried the outfit on with the shirt and the pants and then I tried some heels on and it looked really pretty it looked really dressy I I really liked it and it's it's a really nice outfit I would feel comfortable wearing it to work it, it looks professional enough a uh, professional enough uh, professional enough for me to wear to work but at the same time I think that um, it would be really cute for like if I'm going out to dinner with my husband or maybe a girls night or something like that you I I would wear it to church even. It's a really pretty outfit. But like I said, I call them pants man repellers because I knew my husband wasn't going to like them. And I and so any type of fashion where men just don't get it or they probably won't like it, I call them man repeller. Because a lot of times women we wear we wear clothes for other women and not for men or for ourselves. I like them, so that's all that matters. So there's that. Um I also got another shirt and this one was very cute um oh and you know what these pants the shirt the black shirt was $16.90 and the pants were only $14.90 so that was a good deal I think I got one more shirt which was $13.90 and it is a navy blue yellow and green and then the yellow and the green part are sheer and then the blue is like a um a navy blue like a color blocking shirt just the basic shirt is really cute it actually fits really nice with the blue pants that i bought the um the trouser pants um so there's that 
one of the like I was so excited when I saw these I got a pair of shoes and um, they were just so cute I was so excited if you can see them they have they're like a nude color and they're peep toe and they have a bow in the front and then it pretty much has gold studs over the whole bow and just along the whole side of the shoe platform it's a covered platform um, they only had two pairs of shoes two of these left and one in my size so don't you love when that happens uh, they're just gorgeous you can never have too many nude shoes and then the studs I feel like it it's a really girly feminine shoe but the studs make it a little bit edgy or rock and rollish I don't know but I was really excited when I saw these and um, I also went to Forever 21 at the mall and we have a Forever 21 where I live but this their Forever 21 was like three times the size of mine um, and truthfully it was so huge that I just didn't even really bother looking through it but I did look at the accessories and I found just some bracelets to add to my arm party and I saw a lot of cute bracelets and accessories at both stores at Love Culture and Forever 21 but I have a, a issue with buying things that I think I can make I mean I just hate to pay for something if I can make it but um, these ones I can't make them I don't think um, so there's just some regular you know gold bangles and then there was some fabric covered ones and I really was really liked it because they're really bright colors this looks blue but it's a green so it's like purple green red orange and pink and it's just really really bright so it'll be good for when I wear some of my color pants and stuff over the summer so I got this at forever 21 and it was six dollars and eighty cents and then I did actually get one more thing at love culture but I'm wearing it so it's my outfit of the day um, and I've been looking for just the black maxi dress and I have actually do have a black maxi dress and I have tons of black dresses but all of them have something extra on them I wanted a, a plain black dress that I can wear anything with if I want to put a blazer on it I can put a blazer on it I can wear a shirt over it maybe wear a belt um, you know just change it up however I want depending on the shoes make it casual or make it dressier or professional for work so I found one at Love Culture and this dress was 16 or 17 dollars I think um, and it's just a long black t-shirt dress and I'll actually show you the dress and if you see the back of it too so it's just a, a long black t-shirt dress and then I put on a white it's a sheer white button down um, I think it's called a fishtail hem. It has the longer hem because you know I can't wear sleeveless stuff to work. Not it's not thin sleeves like that. And I just wore that over it. Kind of kept it simple. Uh, I wore my favorite shoes, which you might be tired of looking at, but there's those. Jewelry, my bracelets, of course and earrings that I made mm. I don't know if you can see them that well maybe if I put some color behind them you'll be able to see them a little bit better oops this way yeah there you go and um, they're just like clear beads and I added the chain to them and kind of just put them on a, a hoop that I made and that's it that's my outfit thanks for watching and I'll put